Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Bye. Oh, hey. Do you miss the days when getting a phone call meant you were tethered to about a three to four foot radius? Well, I know I do. And I'm constantly looking for other ways to make myself look like a complete and utter dork. So I think I found another solution for that. Let's take a look. This is the 1966 Monophone, produced here in British Columbia for BC Tel, which would later become TELUS, one of Canada's largest service providers. Now, unless you have a landline at home, like you pay for one, you're not going to have much luck getting this thing working in today's modern world. But I may have just found a creative solution which would make you look like a complete doofus in your home or in your office. So let's give this thing a whirl. We just have to wait for somebody to call, I guess. Not that anyone would call me today, of all days. Hello, Ron? Ron of Ron's Computer Videos? You're a subscriber? Well, thanks. You want to sign up for my Patreon? No? Oh, okay. Can't win them all, I guess. When I first started researching how to connect this chunky old guy to the modern world, I came across a device known as a Bluetooth gateway. Now, my first search result was a bit pricey. At $170 Canadian, this X-Link was a bit much for a novelty device. Now, essentially what these devices will do is take your RJ11 landline cable, connect it to a Bluetooth module. That Bluetooth module pairs with your phone. And that would allow a old device like this rotary phone to act as a separate handset. Now, I did end up finding one that was a little more budget friendly. This is the Cell 2 Jack. And at 55 Canadian, it was worth the novelty, I suppose. And it's about the size of a pack of gum. Now this simply operates off a five volt USB power supply. And once we connect it, it already begins to go into pairing mode. Feed it your RJ11 cable to your phone and you're done. Now for an old rotary phone, you can't give it the instruction sets for the pound and number keys to actually pair it. But with the newest firmware for version 6, all you have to do is take it off the receiver and it'll show up in your searchable devices. And once paired, you're ready to start making and receiving phone calls. Now I can actually dial out, order pizza, or prank call my mother-in-law. Well, that's about it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go. Star 69, your mom. <laughs> it takes a while.